In this video, I'm going to overview a Reliance Controls Power Inlet Receptacle. I will discuss important facts and details about this product no one else is covering. At the end, I will compare this product to other receptacles I personally reviewed and discuss if this product is worth your hard-earned money. I am holding the 50 amp version. Note, Reliance does make a 30 amp and 20 amp model. Everything discussed in this video will also apply to the smaller units. The blades look like they're made out of brass or brass alloy. There is no specification sheet on their website to confirm. The lack of specifications by Reliance is disappointing. This is all they provide on their website. Competitors do provide such specification, where it clearly outlines all relevant information of the product in great detail. Unfortunately, Reliance does not provide such information. Moving on to the enclosure. The unit comes with a metal enclosure with a lid that is rated NEMA 3R. That means it can be installed outside. This enclosure is very shallow, coming in at two and a half inches. It's almost as if Reliance designed this to be a wireless receptacle. Look at this shot closely. You are somehow supposed to cram four wires into this enclosure. There is less than half inch between the back of the receptacle and the metal enclosure. This violates wire bending space requirements required by the electrical code. Apparently, Reliance doesn't know or doesn't care, or maybe both. This is completely unacceptable. Moving on to the receptacle casing. It's completely made out of cheap plastic. When you put it on the scale, it reads 3.9 ounces. This unit is designed and manufactured in the US and costs about $83 on Amazon. Here's a table comparing this Reliance unit with commercial grade competitors. You can see the Leviton unit is two times heavier than this Reliance, and the Hubble unit is almost three times as heavy. When it comes to electrical equipment, it's best to stick with name brand commercial grade equipment. None of this cheap knockoff crap. This is what happens when you buy a poor quality receptacle. 50 amps is no joke and should not be taken lightly. A lot of heat is generated, and if the receptacle is made of poor quality materials, it will disintegrate. It's not worth risking the safety of your home and your family. While I personally do not recommend this Reliance unit to anyone, I do recommend this one. This unit is made and sold by General Electric. Look at the size difference. You actually have room to install wires. I'll be posting a full review shortly. If you found this helpful, consider subscribing for more electrical videos.